The Smurfs, Smurfs' Lucky Day At the end of the story, three surprise questions await you. Please subscribe and like the video. Thanks! In the heart of the magical forest, the Smurfs were busy preparing for their annual Lucky Day celebration. Every year, on this special day, a mysterious golden clover would appear somewhere in the village. The Smurf who found it would have a whole year of good luck. Papa Smurf gathered everyone in the village square. Remember, Smurfs, the golden clover could be anywhere. Search high and low, but most importantly, have fun. Smurfette, with her bright blue dress and golden hair, decided to start her search near the river. She skipped along the path, humming a happy tune, and kept her eyes peeled for the shimmering clover. Meanwhile, Brainy Smuff, with his thick glasses and book in hand, thought the clover might be hidden in one of the many books in the village library. He was so engrossed in his search that he didn't notice Clumsy Smuff stumbling right behind him. Oops, sorry Brainy. Clumsy apologized after knocking over a stack of books. Clumsy, you need to be more careful, Brainy sighed, adjusting his glasses. Out in the fields, Hefty Smuff was using his strength to move boulders and logs, hoping the clover was hidden underneath. As the sun began to set, many Smurfs started to feel a little discouraged, but not Smurfette. She believed the golden clover was still out there, waiting to be found. Just then, she noticed a faint golden glimmer coming from a patch of flowers near the old oak tree. Could it be? Smurfette whispered to herself. She gently parted the flowers and there it was, the golden clover. Papa Smurf, Papa Smurf, I found it. Smurfette called out, her voice filled with joy. All the Smurfs gathered around, cheering and clapping. Papa Smurf smiled warmly, congratulations, Smurfette. This will indeed be a lucky year for you. That night, the Smurfs celebrated with music, dancing, and a feast under the stars. The village was filled with laughter and happiness, and Smurfette felt the luckiest of all. Questions Where did Smurfette find the golden clover? What did Brainy Smurf think the golden clover might be hidden in? How did Clumsy Smurf accidentally interrupt Brainy's search?